Hi everyone, it's day 11 of my training and today is going to be overhead press day. So normally on a Friday I like to finish with overhead press. I'm going to be pushing it up to 50 kilos uh, and we'll be doing five sets uh, of five reps at 50 kilos. Um, and I've been working on uh, a sort of, I'll be working on a new training plan as well coming up because I don't want to start to think I'm going to be plateauing on the exercises that I'm working on at the moment. So I'm sort of trying to gather as much information as I can to try and organise my own sort of programme really um, to help me get stronger and move forward. Another thing is um, the diet that I'm going on. I'm actually looking at changing the diet because the foods I, I eat are fantastic and great but I'm struggling because it's lacking chicken and steak and iron and protein and, and bits and pieces that I would prefer so I'm going to be looking at a more of a, a calorie style diet calorie controlled style of diet um, where I'm not limited to what I can eat but obviously it's the portion size it's all to do with I mean losing weight is all to do with how much you eat at the end of the day so you know if you're eating more calories than what your body needs then you're going to get fat and if you eat less you're going to lose calories and ultimately lose fat and lose weight so that's what i'm gonna be working on at the moment so yeah great great things uh, also i'm gonna be looking at uh doing voiceover from now on rather than writing on the actual screens because uh as i've told you guys before i'm new to youtube so i'm gonna be looking at um different ways of recording my voice over pictures and videos that i'm posting just because i think it'll be a lot easier for people um i will be obviously putting comments on there um you know for people to see as well uh, what i'm thinking at the time and also it helps to see what i'm thinking after i've recorded the videos because it's not always easy to say what you think when you're in the moment of actually doing the exercise so that's what i'll be doing at the moment and i'm going to be looking at just my editing skills because again this is all new to me so i'm just you know just been going to be trying to uh, sort that out um other youtubers i've been looking at other youtubers um which have doing some fantastic stuff uh, and they keep me motivated in terms of keep producing videos. I'm only doing this for my own self motivation um, and the fact that my kids think I'm crazy and doing it and they think I'm nuts. So which I find funny. So I just think it's hilarious that um, they actually uh, put me on the TV at home um, and uh, and they can see me in life and see me on telly. Uh, my youngest thinks I'm some sort of film star because I've seen me on TV. So bless him. But um, we'll take it from there and see what happens with it. All right, guys, I'll speak to you soon. Take care. Okay, so here you can see me repping uh, my first PR, which was um, a one rep, mech, uh, one rep max at 70 kilos. To be honest, it felt really easy. Um, so I decided to rep it three times, as you can see in the video. Um, I felt really strong and comfortable and I thought to myself I've, I've never come this far before um, especially as like three or four weeks ago I could barely do 60 kilos so I was very very happy with what I produced so I moved on to my uh, next weight okay here I'm just admiring what 80 kilos look like to be honest with you <laughs> so um, I'm just thinking to myself Am I going to lift it, yes or no? And to be honest with you, I'm thinking I'm just going to crack it in and do my best. Here, to be honest with you, I'm just talking to the camera, saying to myself, 80 kilos for one rep. Let's try and do my best. But to be honest, I've not felt that weight before above my head and I was a little bit nervous. But after, you know, thinking to myself, do you know what? What can you lose from giving it a go? From going from my 60 kilogram a one rep max two weeks ago to now to 80 kilos one rep max um at the end of the day you know you need motivation and this really was motivating me to get to that weight um for a reason that it's it's a competing weight that i'd be happy and comfortable with to go in with so i thought to myself let's just go for it and after being so pleased with myself after the progress i thought to myself Do you know what I'm going to go on the uh, standing calf press and see if I can lift the full weight on the calf press. And I dropped it to the bottom weight, stood down. I thought, you know what, I'm just going to hit this as well. And I was so happy to do, I think it was about a set of 8 to 10. Uh, sorry, a rep of 8 to 10 on this on this press. 
that I was feeling very, very strong today. And I've decided it's called Friday, PR Friday, just for the pure fact that I seem to do all my best work on a Friday when I think I'm I'm the most tiredest. So I don't know, go figure. I then moved on to the leg press where I felt that I could easily break the 300 kilo mark. So I thought I'd film myself doing it at this weight just to see where I stand and uh, if I could actually achieve what I wanted to do. And then after finally sitting at that weight, I thought to myself, I felt so comfortable, I'll try and rep it. So that's exactly what I did. And to be honest, I felt really comfortable. So I was really happy with today's progress. We have hit two PRs today. That's two PRs today. I'm really excited, really happy, really chuffed with myself. Um, didn't think I was going to do it. And the reason I'd done it was obviously I wanted a bit more motivation for myself to see where I am after uh, you know a few weeks of training. Um, cramped it up. Eight rep max. Uh, it was my one rep max on the overhead press is now 80 kilos, which I'm ecstatic about as it's sort of a starting novice competing weight for the log press. Um, really, really chuffed. Um, you know, it didn't hurt me back. I, I was feeling tired. I could feel I was shaking a bit. So, very impressed with that. Second PR was my leg press, which I managed to get up to 310 kilos. Woo! <laughs> which, uh, woo, that's not a noise, is it? Yeah! No, no, that's not, that's not it either. Um, so yeah, I'm just really, really chuffed that the, the, my grind and what I'm doing is actually getting on. And in other news, uh, I've actually got my MRI scan. Come on, um, which is going to be this um, Sunday, believe it, half nine in the morning on Sunday. What hospital was open at half nine in the morning on Sunday? But yeah, it's at me, uh, a local hospital to me. I had a phone call yesterday to say that I'm going to have my MRI scan. Really, really happy with that. I want to see what's going on with my back. I want to get this stuff sorted. I want to see if it's any muscle damage. I want to see if it's. Uh, just me being fat and uh, I'm having a weak core. I want to see if there's any spine issues or any issues with uh, my discs or anything like that. And uh, just see where we go with it. So, yeah, fantastic. Going to get that done. I'll keep you guys posted with my results of that. But, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to getting that all sorted out as well. So then at least I can work on my training around the issues with my back and move forward with it. As usual guys, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you like the content. I'm trying to bring more and more um, you know, videos and give more and more information on what I'm up to and what I'm doing. Um, if you enjoy the videos and you enjoy obviously uh, looking at what I do, uh, please like and subscribe. Um, we'll have a chat, mention things in the comments if you want to. I'm quite happy to talk to people or if there's any exercises you want me to do. Uh, I'll incorporate it as well because I am working on a, a program, a beginner program that has helped me as a larger person uh, get stronger. So uh, yeah, I'll keep you updated with that. So anyway, have a good weekend guys and I shall see you soon. Take care.